Hi Aquarius, it's Tuesday. Going to do a quick read for you guys. I'm just shuffling the cards. It is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. It is general. So cannot resonate for everyone. Sometimes bits and pieces resonate, some, you know, and others don't. Please take what resonates and discard the rest. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. It's a brand new channel, so I welcome you and invite you to join me on my YouTube journey. Please hit like, share, subscribe. I'm checking for new subscribers every day, all day. Hint, hint. <laughs> and I respond to all comments, so please leave a comment below and let me know how it resonated. All right, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising. Venus. Why am I doing one more? I'm not sure. All right, here we go. Okay, let's get started. King of Pentacles. Three of Wands. Two of Swords. This is your energy or your person's energy. So thinking about being stability, looking to the future, and indecisive. Hmm. In your energy or their energy, Eight of Cups, walking away, confusion involving a Leo or an air sign. Doesn't have to be involving the truth. This could be about the truth, cutting someone out. Um, or you know, flat out giving someone a piece of your mind, telling somebody what you think in a not so nice way. The Queen of Swords, she's all about the truth, but she'll she'll she doesn't she wants the truth, and if she doesn't like it or you don't give it, she can she can be pretty vicious. <clears throat> Again, Leo, we've got strong Leo energy here. King of Cups, this is combined mutual energy. High Priestess, Pisces, Cancer. Somebody who's intuitive or knows secrets but doesn't tell them. Combine energy, strength. Leo again. I'm going to say Leo because it's twice already. Um, King of Cups, somebody who showed love. High Priestess is Cancer Pisces energy but also stands for somebody that is either very intuitive or knows things. The, the high priestess is, is someone who knows things but doesn't always speak it. Page of Pentacles in the recent past, King of Swords, Libra energy. Hmm. Again, we've got truth. Emperor. Interesting. Let's look at outcome and the outcome, please. Making a decision and a victory, but people, there's a victory here, but people get hurt, you know? Again, victory. So we have a good outcome. Four cups. Okay, so back to your energy or your person's could be reversed. We have four of cups. So, you know, thinking about a love offer, not wanting to let go of it. Hmm. Oops. Nine of pentacles in reverse. Not wanting to be alone. Not wanting to not be without this again letting not you know hanging on somebody doesn't want to let go of this either you or your person more for Aquarius please oh shoot dropped on the floor um the star card so wishing wishes healing More for Aquarius, please. Five of Cups. Nine of Wands. Ugh. Pain, pain, pain. <sighs> A 
What happened here? What happened here, please? In the recent past, uh-oh. A couple fell, hold on. Nine of Cups. Maybe at a get together or celebration. Maybe too much drinking involved. Uh, love was offered. Causing a heartbreak. And conflict. More please. What is this conflict about? <clears throat> Five of Wands. What is this? Five of Wands, please. The Lovers. Defending Love. Hmm. Seven of Wands, please. This is Seven of Wands. Judgment. I guess it's defending a decision, making a decision about what, please. Okay, one more. Knight of Wands about quick action. Somebody came in fast and furious here. Why are we so stuck now, though? Why is there confusion? What are we walking away from? An empress? Oh. Walking away from... Do we have... Oh, a soulmate. Walking away from a soulmate. Something heavy ended here or is ending. A lot of pain. A lot of love. Why is this all happening, please? Yeah, three. So something new came happened with someone new, but there was something, there was a soulmate situation that needs to end. Yeah. What is this truth about, please? Um, two of Swords. What is, why is Aquarius thinking, it, thinking the Two of Swords? What are they stuck about? Ace of Swords, again, truth. Telling the truth, an apology. Taking action about the truth, right above the High Priestess. Not telling, I don't know. Priestess knows but doesn't tell, right? Or it's the truth about a Pisces Cancer. Justice, fair, marriage. There could be a marriage ending here. This also could be trying to decide what's right and fair. And the outcome we have making a decision. And there is a victory after a battle. The outcome looks good for you. Somebody makes a decision. Let's see. More flyers. Let's go to a new deck. This deck is getting kind of tired. We're going to go to the Radiant <clears throat> Rider Weight in its minis. I love this deck. Let's find out what's going on here. Oh, goodness. Could be someone from the past or just thinking about the past. High Priestess again. Five of Cups again. Ten of Cups. 
Yeah, something's ending. Is it with you, though? Ten of Pentacles. Something that was stable is ending. So I'm thinking marriage. Yeah, okay. Somebody's walking away from their empress, which is wife. Somebody's leaving their, their spouse. Wife doesn't have to be a female. Persons, your person's energy, worlds can be reversed. What is this? Um, Queen of Swords, please. A page of Pentacles, communication. What is this Queen of Swords, please? Is this about cutting someone out? More about the truth. Stalemate. Nine of Cups. Uh -oh. Seven of Wands. Somebody's confused about the truth or cutting someone out. Something to do. I feel like there's something to do with the truth. I guess the truth about the new person or about what happened, infidelity is what I'm seeing. Um, regardless, your, your, your outcome is good. We just pulled a Ace of Cups. So new love. Truth about what happened, the new love here, King of Pentacles. Could be an earth sign involved. Devil hanging on, feeling bound. So I think that's it. That's all I'm getting. I'm not getting anything really new. Oh. Ten of Swords in reverse. I think somebody's going to end up letting go of the pain, letting go of the the past marriage, it looks like someone's getting divorced. Your outcome, Aquarius, is a decision is going to be made. It's going to hurt people, but it's a victory. And then success, victory again. So that's your outcome with your king of wands. Wands again. Three wands in the outcome. Very likely a fire sign. Sun in reverse. It's Leo. Maybe there could be a Leo involved here. We had Leo twice, right? And there's confused. The person that somehow there's a Leo involved here. And a marriage that's ending. And over some new beginning yeah i mean that's the story it's a marriage is ending some that there's a new love and it could be a soulmate but another soulmate relationship is ending for the new one is what it looks like and there is success at the end so hang in there i'm sorry if you're caught up in the middle of this aquarius but there is success in the end queen of cups I know you guys are all about fairness, so this is probably really hard for you. Either you are the... I don't think you're the one being left. You're, I think your person is having to leave someone, and they're doing it for you. And something's still going on here with the truth that I haven't quite figured out. So let me know in the comments, but it's something to do with the truth. But justice... There is... Justice will be had. And, again, and this is also marriage. So the truth will come out if it hasn't already. All right, that's it. Okay, Aquarius, come see me again. Please leave me a, a comment. Let me know. I'm very curious about this. Um, I'm having a lot of, of reads about, you know, breakups and new loves and, you know, cheating. And anyway, I, let me know. Let me know what's going on here and um, things that I didn't, that Tara didn't tell us. Okay or for your specific situation. And um, 
I'll see you guys soon. Bye, Aquarius.